So as you guys know, week 10 is usually the last week of the challenges. So that's why we're not going to be looking at the challenges for Eververse. We're going to be looking at Amethyst Bloom. This is not the greatest shader. I'm not the biggest fan of that brown right there. Uh, the purple and pink are interesting colors, but everything else is just kind of bad. We have Regal Daring, which I'm definitely going to make a video about this because this is a really good shader. Hopefully I can make a shader video for this one because it is really, really good. And I really love this shader. We have other stuff that I don't care about. I mean, to be fair, most people, most of you might care about it. So let's just look at it. Sandcastle effects, which transmit effects. I don't care. Buoy trap, buoy, buoy trap. Yeah, buoy trap, um, which I actually like this ghost. Um, just not for however much bright yet. Yeah, almost 3000 bright dust and then double Dutch, which is. Yeah, that's it. We have the stuff at the bottom. We have a buried treasure projection. I would never, I will never care about projections. We have Raging Lupus or Lepus, which is the Jade Rabbit ornament, which is the red one. I like this one just because it's red and black and I, I'm a hunter main. So red and black is usually a color scheme that I would go for. We have Well Traveled, which actually looks pretty cool. Looks decent, very much um, Rocket Man. I don't remember what it's called, but like not Rocket Man, but it's like something else. But it reminds me of that style, specifically the helm. We have Off My Lawn, which I want this only because it has the grass effect. We have Festive Nest Shell, which looks cool. We have Guardian Glaive. And then we have Moat Juggle. Yeah. And then for the bottom stuff, we have Regal Daring, which again, just a shader from up there. It looks really, really good. I'll show you a little bit more in depth later, just because this armor set's not really doing it justice. We have Golden Age Wine, which I'm not the biggest fan of this one. And the shader is blue, so it's just overall not a good shader in my opinion. Oiled Algae, this is the white version. Yep, um, this is the white version compared to the black version. Every, just basically everything that's white or this like teal color, not teal, light blue uh, is just reversed. So it's all black. And then Tangerine Gloss, which I don't hate this shader. It's just the orange. I hate the shader. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I hate the shader like quite a lot. So that's pretty much it. Let's actually go in depth or not in depth because I will make an individual video about this shader because I do think it's worth it. Um, But let me see real quick. Um, Where are you? Where are you? <laughs> Sorry, it's uh should be. Yeah, it's right there. So this shader is super dope because it's a really good white and gold, but it's also a really good red. So like the red is probably my favorite part of it. <clears throat> that being said, like you guys can see right here, it has a really cool texture. I'm trying to see if I can find an armor set that has the off color because I don't remember. This is what I get for not playing Destiny 2 for like a long time. So this is probably the best example. You guys can see there's an actual design in the red and that's super, super cool because again, this shader is really good. It's actually like one of my more favorite shaders in the game, like I said. And let me see, I just, I know off colors, off color. Well, there's this one right here, which looks super cool. Like again, I, I am, I'm in love with this red because it's not like your traditional red. It's it's a much more deep, much more dark red and not even red, more like burgundy, I guess you would say. I uh, see. Let's see. That's another one. Looks really, really good. So for me personally, you're definitely going to want to combine like a very bougie look with this shader. Obviously, this is a really good example, but there's other ones like this one I think would be a really good one as well. I say I think because I don't know if some of these will be off colors, even that even though that wouldn't be a problem. Yeah, so like I like this. This looks super cool. My only gripe is there's not enough of this red. But again, the red is going to be an off color. So just be aware you're going to have to basically mix and match uh, an armor set that utilizes a lot of the off color. So I will be explaining Regal Daring in depth in the video a little bit more just because i do think this shader is worth doing that because again the shader is really really good but let me know what you guys think i will be doing the ada video soon so be looking out for that be safe i will see you guys later